I'm breaking gender stereotypes with my sons and here's how. When my oldest was four, he asked for nothing more than a play kitchen for his birthday. And honestly, I even grappled with this because I was more worried about what other people would think than what was actually okay. But then I got to thinking about it and he sees his dad cook. He sees his dad do the dishes. Why wouldn't he want a kitchen set? So he got a kitchen set and he loved it. Over the summer, I was painting my nails and my sons came up and were like, I want to paint my nails. And I was like, okay, cool. We painted their toenails because that's what they wanted. And even then, I still grappled with it because I'm still learning how to deal with that. But then the other day, my son came up to me and he's six now. And he said, mom, I really want Gabby's dollhouse for my birthday, but I don't want my cousin to make fun of me. For some context, his older cousin is someone my son highly looks up to. And I said, okay, why do you care what he thinks? And he said, because he would say that it's a girly toy. I said, well, who says, who says it's a girly toy? Do you like it? And he said, yeah, I love Gabby's dollhouse. I wish I could get small like Gabby so that I could go play inside the dollhouse. I was like, yeah, me too, man. That sounds awesome. And he was like, but I don't want, I don't want my cousin to make fun of me for it. And I was like, well, if you like Gabby's dollhouse, that is all that matters. It doesn't matter what I think. It doesn't matter what dad thinks. It doesn't matter what your brother thinks. It doesn't matter what your cousin thinks. If you like it, that is all that matters. If it makes you happy, that is all that matters. And if somebody else has an issue with it because they view it as girly, then that has to do with them, not you. Because so often, so many times, people equate household tasks and childcare tasks with femininity. And that's why so many marriages are unequal because men view those as emasculating tasks, cooking, cleaning, laundry, child rearing, child care. Who says that though? Who says that? You say that. So if you don't say that, if you say, if you're a man enough to say, that does not define my masculinity and you can see past the gender stereotypes and norms, then that's where actual change happens. And I'm starting it right now with my sons so that they know when they get older and they look for a partner, they are supposed to be accountable for the same equal amount of work regardless of what the task is at hand. Because it's not about masculine and feminine. It's about a partnership.